I'm Jess and welcome to Jess Science. Today we're going to be looking at a strategy game called NIM, or as I like to call it, Bet You Can't Win. So for this one, the goal is to remove things, and I'm just using these beads, but you can have it be anything you have lying around, and you'll need 20 of them. And you want to be the last one to take them away. Now each time you rotate with an opponent and you can take one, two, or three. So let's take a quick look. You'd ask someone if they'd want to go first, and hopefully they say yes. That makes it a bit easier for you. Now look closely. So if they say yes, uh, they can take one, two, or three. So let's say they take one. I'll take three. Let's say they take two. I'll take two. Then if they won't take one, I take three. If they take two, I take two. If they take three, I take one. I win. The trick is being multiples of four. So if you keep at that multiples of four, where you're always adding up to it, then you'll always win. That's why when they take one, you take three. When they take two, you take two. It gets a little bit more challenging if they say you go first, but hopefully they don't know the trick. So if that happens, you just need to get back to those multiples of four. So I always start if I'm going first by taking one, because hopefully they just take two and then you can take one and you're back on track. They take one, you take three and so on and you have won yet again. Or if I take one and they take three, that's okay, I'll try again. I'll take one and hopefully this time maybe they take one, I take two and we're back on track. So give it a try. Now you can test it out by using these rows like this to make it a bit easier. But then when you face your first opponent, make sure to take them a little bit more randomly so they can't figure out what the trick is. I'll leave you to it. That's been Just Science. Bye.